Hi guys, how are you doing? Welcome to today's Pick A Card Reading and it is his or her current thoughts. So this is just a very short snapshot reading for you. Um, it might be a general look at your situation. It might be specifically um, about something that's on your mind regarding the relationship. Either way, it is his or her current thoughts. So um, take it however it resonates with you. All right, so we've got group one. Group two, group three. I'm going to do some extra information with this little Kawaii deck. Okay. So let's get on with it. Here's or her current thoughts. Hi, guys. How are you doing, group one? Here's or her current thoughts. We've got Princess of Discs, Eight of Wands, Seven of Wands, Ten of Discs, Princess of Cups. Listen to the music. Okay. What this is telling me, um, Princess of Discs is the um, page of coins, page of discs. Um, we've got the Princess of Cups as well, so the Page of Cups. There's a lot of new beginnings with this person. There's a lot of dreamy energy with this person. There's a lot of feeling content, a lot of feeling like they are um, heading for something new that they feel is a dream come true. It could be that it's... What I'm saying is it sounds like this person's in a fantasy. No, they're not because they've got ten of coins... Seven of Wands and Eight of Wands. Okay, so what I'm seeing is that this person is heading for success. They've got success on their mind. They're pretty grounded, but they are also living the dream. So, and listen to the music is really saying to me here, it's like enjoying life. So this person is on a new adventure and they want to really kind of enjoy life, make the most of life. The Seven of Wands is the only kind of fly in the ointment here. And I feel like there could be a bit of tall poppy syndrome going on for this person. So, you know, they might have people against them or people that, you know, uh, want to kind of stop their success or sabotage them. There could be a bit of self-sabotage here as well with this being their thoughts. Um, I'm not sure whether this sabotaging is external or internal. But basically, this person is following a new dream they're really enjoying success um, and it's, pay, you know, their, their efforts, their work, their inspiration, whatever it is that's going on in them, it's paying off. Um, yeah, so it, it's actually very positive. It's beginning stages of this new positive direction, but I think it's going to pay off very nicely for this person. So let's have a look at some clarifiers. Yeah, eight of wands. Yeah, this person is thinking forwards, moving forwards. It's not just that they're thinking about moving forwards. I think things are moving forwards. Yeah, Knight of Cups. Um, so there's an offer to be made. This person, yeah, look, Knight of Cups, King of Cups. So we've got the Princess of Cups, the Knight of Cups and the King of Cups. So this is about progressing in love. This is about progressing in passion. This person is looking to grow, to develop, to move forwards and, and they're enjoying the process. So that is their current thoughts. I hope that's helpful. Loads of love guys. See you on the next reading. Bye for now. Hi group two, how are you doing? I hope you're great. So let's have a look at his or her current thoughts. We've got the six of swords, the eight of coins, the prince of wands, the prince of discs and clear, clean up your mess. Okay, so this person, is it's interesting because the previous group had two princesses and you've got two princes, which is kind of funny. Um, so, uh, and also with the Eight of Coins and the Six of Swords, both of these cards are about moving on. We've got clean up your mess. We've got moving on energy. We've got prince energy, which is taking action. Okay, so this person, for this person, their thoughts are... It's all about sorting their life out. They are currently thinking, okay, I need to get myself sorted. They might need to take a trip or it's a metaphorical trip. They're going from the sort of darkness towards the light, the shadow into the light. They're trying to kind of clean things up, sort things out. They could be, if you're in a no, no contact or a, a period of quiet or separation, this is about self-mastery. This is about being alone, getting on with things, sorting things out, carving out a new path or um, a path towards mastery. 
with the two princes we've got prince of coins and prince of wands so this person is could be focusing on work and passion um they might be moving slowly maybe more slowly than you would like but this person is focused on sorting their life out getting things in order sorting things out so that they can then move forwards yeah knight of cups yeah so we've got another this is night this is night this is night so this is all about taking action i feel like with the knight of cups here as well this is about wanting to make an offer and it's like i can't make an offer until i've sorted out all my mess until i know what i'm doing until i'm in the right direction once i'm on the right course and in the right direction then I can offer something. Yeah, 10 of wands. This person's got a lot of responsibility on their shoulders. Um, they're really focused on that responsibility. I've just dropped some cards, but I'll pick them up after. It's fine. Um, yeah, four of swords. They're not ready to move forwards with something because they're still recovering from something, still sorting something out. So I hope this makes sense. Loads of love, guys. See you on the next reading. Bye for now. Hi, group three. How are you doing? So this is, um, I got it upside down. Um, his or her current thoughts. We've got 10 of cups, 10 of swords, four of cups, six of cups. Take no offense. Okay. So this person's current thoughts are, we've got a double 10 here. Every group has had like a double card. The first was a double 